basically, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but he uh, he pushes you hard when you come up here, right? You defeat Adonis and Murdoch for the tag titles. Uh, you and Mike Rotundo. Um, any thoughts on Murdoch and Adonis? Well, Murdoch, I mean, I loved Murdoch when I was out in Texas going to college. Uh, I traveled with Murdoch as much as I could. And then uh, after I was out of college, we were in the Amarillo Territory for about six or eight months, and I traveled with him every night. But, I mean, he was just, Dickie was, uh, he was one of those talents that, I mean, he could have been world champion. He could have been anything he wanted to be, but he just, he just screwed around all the time in the ring. And he, he was a true talent. So you didn't take it serious, is what no, you're saying? No, not at all. And Adonis, I don't know. I don't know. If, I can't. I can't remember anybody that really got along with Adonis or liked him. Really? Yeah. Interesting. To, We're huge fans of Adonis. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but yeah, but I, I've heard that. I heard he had a lot of problems really? with a lot. Did, did you ever have problems with Adonis at all, personally? I never had personal problems with him, but you know, I just you know, was, just not a nice guy. Hey, how you doing? Def, define Dick Murdoch, not. Taking it seriously, what would he do in the ring that would be, you know? Well, I mean, you know, like he would take bumps and do like Curly and the Three Stooges. Perfect for you. I'm loving this. Oh, oh my god, that's yeah. great, dude. That's perfect. That for you. is. It's great. You should be a big Mar- Murdoch mark. Yeah. <laughs> oh my, I love Dick Murdoch. I always, I always, I, yeah. That's funny. I don't know, oh man. My God, I never looked at Murdoch that way. I'm gonna have to check that Murdoch out. Now. Was great, but now I'm gonna have to go back and check out the curly. But you, you're in the WWE. You guys, you know, I remember you, you and uh, you when you guys came up. You guys were hot. Very. Uh, not many people know this, but the U.S. Express, the Hulk Hogan theme was actually your theme first, yeah, right? What's up with that? That was your theme first. How does that end up getting taken from you guys? Did you that, care? I think that happened at the time when uh, when all the royalties for all the music started catching up with everybody because we were using Springsteen's 